What is up, YouTube? Faris here with another episode of Doing Work. This is episode 22 in our series where we get into Soul Calibur 5. We go into the ranked matchmaking system, and I get you guys normally three to five live commentaries of some Soul Calibur 5 action. Gonna be playing some Mitsurugi today, gonna be playing some Yoshimitsu today. Maybe even get a little Astroth in there. We'll see. We'll see. I've tried to do this, uh, let, let's check out this message from EXP Gunner. I actually, this guy just helped me, uh, warmed up. Yeah, see, if you need another warm-up sometime, let me know, lol, smiley face. Well, shout out to you, EXP Gunner, for the warm-up. Um, yeah, just ran a short set with that guy, played some games. You know, if you guys are ever on Xbox Live, you send me a message. I mean, he's a cool guy. All he says is, Faros, you wanna play some games? I say, sure, man, I'll play some games with you. You just wanna get some games in with me? That's cool. Hit me up on Xbox, we'll do it out, man. I love playing with my fans, I love getting those warm-up ins. Because, you know, sometimes I get on this game, I'm cold, I'm rusty, not feeling it. And, um, now I have no excuses. I'm going into ranked right now, I'm actually gonna pick some Yoshimitsu. I have no excuses right now. I mean, if I get bodied, then that's on me. <laughs> I can't say, oh, you know, I didn't have a warm-up, oh, you know, I haven't played in a while. No. Nah, I'm throwing it all on the table right now. Well, I'm probably gonna win this match first off, but I, I need to win my matches here, so... Let's go. Troll mode. Engaged. Come at me. Come at me. Oh, daddy, he is so... <laughs> that should've came out, bros. I don't know what kind of things we got going on here. This guy's going ham. Right, okay. I'm just getting hit on. Alright, get up, Yoshi. We got work to do. We got work to do, son. Come on, let's do some work. Yeah, that's right. We can come back. You guys think I can't come back? Tell me I can't come back. I can come back. I can come back. I can come back. Ready? Ultimate mix-up. <laughs> Came back. <laughs> you know, the only reason I wanted his favor is because I didn't get my foot clap. All right, I need my foot claps now. Wow, it comes out with the GI. Dude's got balls. Oh man, I was tech and B. I don't know Cervantes' throws. I don't even know which one that is. I'd like to get a... Ooh. Where are my low blocks at? Where are my low blocks at? This guy's not bad. Ugh. I think I can door knock her after that. Does anyone know? Pretty sure I can door knock her after that. This guy's got no low blocks. That's why I can't get a launcher on him. I wanted to practice my ear slicer. Come on, ear slicer, Dave. Nope. We just feel like getting on our sword. May as well just go with it. Sometimes you guys, you just gotta go with the flow. <laughs> See, I can't get a fucking... I can't get a launcher on him. He just blocks high all the time. I'm just gonna low all day. Until he gets up into this. Come at me! Yes! <laughs> Doing work! Yeah, we got him. We got the GIs this round. That's it. He should die from that. Look at his name. I just noticed his name. Death. Plus die? I'm just gonna walk up and launch her. I'll finally get my launcher on him. Are you serious? Break! Yes! Ugh. Worked so hard for that launcher. <laughs> I didn't get it. Until the final hit. And then I got two. Combo. Ugh. Alright. Took a game. Let's get some more. Maybe play some Mitsu now, maybe run Yoshi back, I'm not sure. I actually tried this uh, this commentary a couple times, and you know what? I'm not going to spend long on this, but I was talking about random shit other than Soul Calibur. I was talking about depressing, depressing, how do you say it? Depress, depressing shit in real life right now? I'm not even going to talk about it. Not even going to let it fuck with my day, you guys. You know what? We're just here, <laughs> we're enjoying ourselves, and we're playing some Soul Calibur. And that's what we're here to do. So, well, let's talk about something, though. Let's talk about upcoming games coming out. Let's talk about Tekken Tag Tournament 2. Comes out in a couple days, Tuesday. Um, shout out to the dude at my local GameStop. Uh, gave me, I start. I started talking with the dude. And I, because you know, like, I need to pick up a job. Long story short, I think I need to pick up a job. And uh, I'm going to play some Yoshi again for you guys. Is that cool? I'm going to play some more Yoshi. We'll play Mitsu afterwards. Is this a B rank again? But, um, not that that means anything. I ran into S- or Partisan. I ran into SC Partisan, Partisan SC. 
If you guys don't know who he is, he's like some fucking Soul Calibur genius. Ran into him on rank the other day, and he's a B rank, and he just fucking annihilated me. I was like, oh my god, dude's got like 98% win or something. Oh, the, the, that guy. That guy is just legit. But, um, what was I saying? So, oh, drain your, drain my soul! Uh, the dude at my GameStop, right? I start talking to him, because I was trying to get a job there. They have no openings, they never do. But, um, I start talking with the dude, and we, like, became kind of sort of, you know, like, friends on the spot. And the dude, um, he's got some, his own, like, I don't want to say competitive scene, but they do their own little, like, gaming events. In uh, in my local area, there is no like fighting game scene here, but they do their own little events So I like friended their event page on Facebook and shit and the dude messaged me off it and he's like hey, man I got a no just input stamp come at me Damn it. He's like I got a Tekken poster for you at the store uh, If you want to come pick it up and I was like hell yeah, I want to come pick it up So because you know I was telling him about fighting games and shit. Um, he got in little Tekken posters uh, with the Tekken pre-orders and had extra, so he, he shot me one. You guys will see it in a, a future vlog. It's pretty sick, man. So, huge shouts to that dude. This dude's name is Steve. Shouts to Steve and shouts to GameStop for the, uh, for the posters. So I thought that was cool. I don't know how I got into talking about that. Oh, because I was talking about Tekken Tech Tournament 2. Um, well, let's talk about this match for a second. So I'm playing against an Algol. Uh, and I'm kind of just going nuts. I tried to GI there. Let's see. You got 214As and the door knockers. I'm gonna do some hops. Wow, he blocked my launcher? How did that happen? Is that chair gonna land on me? He didn't finish it. Oh, he's got setups. Come here. Um. I don't know why I did that. Why did I do that? Hold on. Get out of here. Give me some space. We got crazy cartwheels. Come at me, damn it! Why doesn't he do a vertical? Why is he doing highs when I'm on the ground? I don't get it. Uh, well, they might be mids that are, but I'm like super tech crouched, so I go underneath them. I don't know. I was trying to get foot claps on that guy all day. I couldn't get it. But anyway, so <laughs> I hope you guys are entertained by this. By the way. But um, all right, we got an A rank. I'm gonna bust out some Mitsu. How hyped are you guys for Tekken Tech Tournament Two? I've talked, to, I've talked to you guys about it in the last couple videos, and um. People seem hyped in the comments, so I'm, I'm glad to see that. Just want to let you guys know, I got that shit pre-ordered on lock in full. I went and traded in some games. And um, I don't know if your guys' local game store is doing this. You should check immediately. If so, my game, sh my uh, uh, GameStop, <laughs> brain fart there, had a special where up until the 9th, not on the 9th, up until the 9th, they were giving you 50% plus on your pre-orders. So you're getting like huge money back from your pre-orders, and um, yeah. So I I pre or not pre-orders. I'm sorry, trade-ins. Fifty percent uh, more on your trade-ins. I'm trying to fight and talk at the same time, and I accidentally said pre-orders because I pre-ordered Tekken or Tekken Tag Two. Hold on, I gotta fight this Yoshi. Let me finish this guy. I got toe pokes and sidestep bees. I got face pokes in between his forward KK. Um, yeah, that's how we do this. That's how we do this. I'll finish that thought in a sec. Hold on. I don't want to accidentally lose or something. No. Mm -mm. He should have had me there. I got all sorts of pokes. No, that hits twice. No second hit that time. He was worried about the face poke, I guess. Oh, we got blocks. Oh, that... Get out of there. And 2k, and he's out. He's out. He's out. Um... That's that. Okay, two rounds up. Havoc X Champ. I'm just gonna go right at him. What? What? Dude fucking teleported! Dude is the champ. Hold on. You... Oh no. He's got damage on me and then mix up. I tried to roll. That catches my rolls. You see, I didn't sidestep B there because I thought he was... Nice! Fuck. Hold on. The critical edge should take his ass out right now. No. Took him to the side. Yeah, that's game though. That's game. I just rushed him down. Good game, Havoc X Champ. Kept me on my toes, dude. You didn't let me talk about GameStop and Tekken. <laughs> Damn you. <laughs> no, that was a good game though. Uh, what was I saying? Steve gave me the poster. Shouts to Steve. Um, yes, okay, excuse me. I had a little blunder in the commentary there. My GameStop, I'm not sure if this is with all GameStops. I'll run it back with the dude. <laughs> He's not going to let me talk about it again. Had it to where. 
on your trade-ins. So when you go and trade in your old games, they gave me 50% more on my trade-ins. They were running a special, and that's why I traded in a bunch of shit. And I got Tekken Tech Tournament 2 and Halo 4 completely paid for. And I only traded in like, I don't even know, like mm, five or six games? Five or six games. So, and they were games that like I was probably never gonna play again. So that was a really good deal. I got my two future big name titles completely paid for. You guys definitely check that out. Um, if you've got any games worth trading in. So now I'm going against this dude's Maxi. I don't know Maxi as much as I know Yoshi, so... We'll see if he can do better here. Wow, I get a crazy whiff. I know that second hit's a high, and that's why I ducked and did my wild crouched 1B. Oh, and I got him on this. I'm gonna see if he knows the Yukemi. Nope. And... 2A afterward. And Okay, I couldn't duck that time. And 2KB to finish it off. Yep, okay. So, he did better there. He was hitting me with Maxi, and you know, Maxi hits you a couple times, and he can take half your life, just like Mitsurugi can. Um, that bastard. <laughs> but Maxi's got trickier strengths. Much more trickier strengths than Mitsurugi does. Yeah. So, it's, it's difficult to stop a Maxi when you don't know what the hell you're doing. Okay, he twitched up into that. Um, try to get 2KB on him. And now I'm gonna try to... Oh, I, I messed up there. I didn't mean to... Do the B forward. I didn't know a low was coming. Fuck. Yeah, he outspaced me. Good round. He outspaced me pretty large there. Okay. I threw that one though. I shouldn't have lost. Wow. Punished 4B from that far? Fuck. I don't know these damn strings, man. Face poke missed. Okay, I can 4B that one. Fuck. You see how much damage that punch did? That's the low. Okay. Get at me. I'll blow the fucking meter because I'm fucking coming back this round. <gasps> yes! <laughs> you see? Some people wouldn't have blown the meter there. That's the only reason I came back. Get out of here with your fucking strings that never stop. Oh my god. Just punch me in the face for massive deeps. He always does the low afterwards. Why aren't I waking up low blocking? Wow, I'm not even getting what I want. Oh, this is huge. Oh, he could be dead. He could be dead. If he wall splats, he's dead. If... Oh, Waika, what the fuck? He went for it right there. Wow. Nice. That was good. That was good. I'm going to show you some Mitsurugi spacing right now, kid. Hmm. That's not spacing. Wow, I, is, that's a fucking combo? Okay. Okay, that's bad. Is that gonna hit me even though I'm... Yeah, that's probably game, you guys. Yeah, dude got me with his wake-up critical edges. Fuck, good game, dude. That was lame. <laughs> that was lame, Maxi. I hope I get a run back on that. <laughs> I'm gonna play one more, you guys. Damn! That sucks. Let Maxi get the better for me. I'm gonna look for him. See if I can get him. <sighs> Shake that one off. So, yeah, what was I talking about? Um, yeah, so I traded in a bunch of games. Games like Modern Warfare 3. Um, I actually bought Persona 4, but I didn't... I liked that game, Persona 4 Arena, Ultimate Arena, whatever. That was a, it was a really strong fighting game. I just didn't really get into it. I didn't really get into it. So I took that. I didn't like. Uh, I don't. Know, it sounds stupid, but those characters were so unique, and they all had like such crazy little like. Okay, like the character I was interested in, for instance, Labrys. Uh, <laughs> I think is how you say her name. Um, <laughs> I feel stupid if it's not, but uh, she's the chick with the huge axe. All right, the Android chick. She looks bomb But she her axe is in like stages and it starts off really shitty and you've got to like build it up over the fight It sounds cool. Okay, I'm just gonna fight this guy But when you're trying to actually learn the character Are you not gonna play me? Okay, good. You can't just learn combos with her you have to learn combos in her different axe stages and like because the greater the stage you're in, the more hit stun you get, the more you can combo, okay? 
And it's like, it had things I didn't like, like auto-comboing and stuff like that, that was like super derpy. You know how other fighting games, like Marvel I think, you can like activate derp mode on the character select screen. You're like, do I want to play normally or do I want to play derp mode? And if you put on derp mode, you can like mash one button and it combos for you. Okay, Persona Arena had that in all the time. And like, I was like, that's so stupid. I don't, I don't want people to be just mashing one button and beating me, you know? And they weren't beating me, but it was just stupid that it had a use, which I, it's not worth talking about. Um, it like builds you extra meter and stuff. This Siegfried's good, so I need to focus right now. Me and this Siegfried go so far back, it's not even funny, dude. Me and him have been going at it since unranked since the beginning of Soul Calibur. And he started off just bodying me. And then, like, I got a little better and was able to at least hold my own. But the dude is fucking godlike. So, I got the throw and I got the ring out. So, I got round one, but I'm not feeling good yet because this guy, <laughs> this guy is just good. He's one of the better Siegfrieds. Um, he reminds me a lot of Skullshade, actually. Skullshade, if Skullshade could, like, AGA and do the instant just frame low. We'll see if this guy does it. Oh, I'm just catching him with everything right now, okay. I don't know why I threw a high when he was crouched. 4B. You know what to do here? I'm surprised he didn't step. This guy probably hasn't played in a while. He's he's old school like me, man. This guy was on all the time when Soul Calibur V first launched, but... I don't know how much he plays anymore. I haven't seen him in a while. Critical Edge. Damn, that was a horrible whiff. I should have gotten punished for that large. Fuck. What am I doing? See, he's just spinning around, owning me. Look at this guy. He's going hamburger. Am I going to block low? Dave, do we got low blocks ever? Oh, oh no. Okay, yeah, he took around. Um, Yeah, he took around. Let's go, Mitsu. Let's just go at him while he's sitting there spinning. I was scared of that hitbox, for the record. Like, for realsies. A plus B. Oh, yes! I love that move so much. Just gonna crouch? No way! Did I just let that happen to me? The worst possible thing I could have let happen to me. I don't know. I wasn't even thinking about it. Alright, he's back in the game right now, you guys. Yeah, I didn't whiff that time, did I? Oh, huge damage. Okay. Yep, I, I got your tech that time. Fuck, I can't believe I dropped my super. I'm not even gonna say why, it was newbie. You guys saw a big mistake there. You see, I auto teched the B version of his ground throw. He was gonna throw me out. Man, dude was going for real. It's like, are you serious? <laughs> Deals the Don. Man, he was gonna scrap that out. Look how many, ga look how many games that guy's played. 5,500 wins? Just over 1,000 losses? Like, wow. That guy has played some fucking Soul Calibur, man. And that guy obliterated me. I couldn't beat him when the game first came out. Like, for real? And I hate to make a benchmark out of this guy. It's just, he infuriated me because when I first started playing that game, like, you guys ever go into ranked and there's just one guy who just pisses you off because you can't beat him. You're just like, man, fuck this guy. I'm going to get him one day. And when I do, it's going to be fucking sweet. That was that guy for me. Uh, I always had so much respect for him because he played Siegfried. But, it, man, I was mad because I just couldn't beat him. You know, first couple weeks into the game. And I just started really training, got better. And then, yeah, that that was the guy that I was like, all right, I am I got better. I know I got better because now I can beat this guy. <laughs> No, but, um, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Started off, you know, a little whatever, uh, with just derpy Yoshi trolling, but, uh, we stepped it up. Showed you guys the loss. I, I show the losses in the videos, man. I wish I would've gotten to run it back with that maxi, because I feel like I kind of got robbed in some areas, some things whiffed uh, that shouldn't have, and I didn't get a wall splat when I should've, in my opinion. <laughs> but, um, it's okay. I'm not making excuses. I just wish I would've got the chance to run it back with that guy. Um... But yeah, I was I was reacting way too slow. He hit me with lowest free. But anyway, I'm done talking about that. That was that was that. I got outplayed. Whatever. Um, <laughs> it's 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 okay to get outplayed sometimes. But yeah, I showed the losses. Like I say, these are, these commentaries are live, unedited. You guys, as always, I'm showing you the ranked online experience. 
and I'm hoping I'm going to be showing you guys the ranked online experience in Tekken Tag Tournament 2 when it comes out on Tuesday. So hopefully you guys are hyped for that. More Final Fantasy XI in the meantime. As always, I'm fucking loving that game right now. Uh, I'm going to work in Final Fantasy XI. It's, it's so much fun. Even though from like a viewer's perspective you guys are probably like wow this is the most boring shit ever <laughs> but it's all right um i haven't got my red mage to too high of a level yet but when i do you guys are gonna see what that game's all about so can't wait to see where the channel's at in the future man got a lot planned tekken halo 4 oh a game that's been like not on my radar because it's so far away and it's still really far away but fantasy star online 2 oh man i am hyped for that I'm just going to take a minute here, you guys, to talk about some things while we're on this derpy screen. Sorry. Um, but, yeah. Fantasy Star Online 2 looks amazing. Uh, it's out in Japan, and there's, like, some people on YouTube just between you and me, and <laughs> they're clearly not from Japan, and they're playing it. So, maybe there's a way for me to get in there. I don't know. Uh, you can look that up for yourself. I might be looking that up for myself here soon. Any Fantasy Star fans, leave in the comments below. Fantasy Star Online 2 looks sick. So, um, looking forward to that. I've got Counter-Strike Go. I don't play it too much. Might make some derpy videos with that as well. And might get into Magic the Gathering on the channel here soon. So there's a lot of ways we can go with the channel. Um, for fighters, I'm looking to focus primarily on Tekken when it comes out. I'm always going to get you guys Soul Calibur footage. But once Tekken comes out, I want to go hard into there and see, like, you know, how much we can expand getting some Tekken fans in here and see how far up we can go in Tekken world. So hopefully that's understandable. But, um, yeah, I haven't actually played it yet, so I don't even know how much I'm going to like it. So that's still to be determined. I'm actually going to get out of here for now, you guys, though. I don't want to talk to you or waste too much of your time here. Let me know what you think in the comments below. If you liked the video, give it a like. If you really liked it, give it a favorite. And until next time, you guys, it's been Faros with YouTube.com slash Faros TTTT. Peace.